hey hello friends once again welcome to ram tube academy thank you for watching my video please like and share the video with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for future notifications in this tutorial we are going to discuss about the bare villiger reaction the bare villiger reaction is an organic reaction in which ketone is converted into an ester or cyclic ketone into a lactone in the following reaction you can see the ketone in the presence of peroxy acid or hydrogen peroxide forms the ester along with the corresponding carboxylic acid of peroxy acid peroxy acid is nothing but carboxylic acid with this extra oxygen and when cyclic ketones undergoes the same reaction conditions they form lactones lactones are nothing but the cyclic esters so in this reaction if you carefully observe the reactant ketone and the product ester you will find oxygen from peroxy acid is introduced in between carbonyl carbon and the most electron rich alkyl group that means in this case r2 is more electron rich than the r1 which migrates on oxygen during the reaction how that happens that we'll see in the reaction mechanism but before that go through this migration order of the alkyl or aryl groups during the bare villiger reaction because that determines what product going to form during the reaction with the asymmetric ketones one type of example is discussed in the assignment section at the end of the video now we will move on to reaction mechanism ketone is reacted with peroxy acid but for better understanding the oxygen of the peroxy acid which gets inserted into ketone and forms ester is shown in the yellow color so the lone pair of electrons of carbonyl carb oxygen abstract proton from peroxy acid and forms this activated electrophile along with the conjugate base of the peroxy acid this conjugate base acts as nucleophile and attacks on the electron deficient carbonyl carbon and forms this intermediate product this intermediate product actually undergoes rearrangement reaction and hence this reaction is also called as bare villiger rearrangement reaction then the lone pair of hydroxyl oxygen gives its electron to this bond which leads to migration of r2 group on this oxygen remember r2 is more electron rich than r1 and this migration breaks the oxygen oxygen bond and forms the product like carboxylate ion and the protonated ester then in the next step carboxylate ion abstracts this proton and forms the final product of the bare villiger reaction that is ester as the oxygen is added in the reactant ketone it is also called as bare villiger oxidation reaction so in the assignment when this ketone is reacted with peroxy acid what will be the major product of the reaction you can pause the video and draw the structure of the product remember one thing you have to follow the migration order what is your answer product a or product b if it's product b you are wrong the migration order tells us that cyclohexyl is more electron rich than the methyl and hence oxygen will in get inserted between the cyclohexyl and the carbonyl carbon and that's why the product a is more feasible if you want to learn more about other name reactions links are given in the description so go through it and subscribe to my channel for upcoming videos once again thanks for watching Goodbye.